Timotheus Shani, 2 Timothy 3. This know also that in the last days perilous times shall come. For men shall be lovers of their own selves, covetous, boasters, proud, blasphemers, disobedient to parents, unthankful, unholy, without natural affection, truce breakers, false accusers, incontinent, fierce, despisers of those, rather, despisers of those that are good, traitors, heady, high-minded, lovers of pleasure, rather, lovers of pleasures more than lovers of Yah, having a form of regard for Yah, but denying the power of Yahweh, from such turn away. For of this sort are they which creep into houses and lead captive silly women laden with sins, led away with diverse lusts, ever learning and never able to come to the knowledge of the truth. Now as Jannies and Jambres withstood Moshe, so do these also resist the truth. Men of corrupt minds reprobate concerning the belief, but they shall proceed no further, for their folly shall be manifest unto all men, as theirs also was. But you have fully known my doctrine, manner of life, purpose, belief, long-suffering, love, patience, persecutions, afflictions, which came unto me at Antioch, at Iconium, at Lystra. What persecutions I endured! But out of them all, Yahuwah delivered me. Yea, and all that will live in the fear of Yahuwah, in Yahusha HaMashiach shall suffer persecution. But evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived. But continue in the things which you have learned and have been assured of, knowing of whom you have learned them, and that from a child you have known the holy scriptures which are able to make you wise unto Yahshua, through belief which is in Yahusha HaMashiach. All scripture is given by inspiration of Yahua, and is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness, that the man of Yah may be perfect, truly furnished, unto all good works.